Please, let's hear it for the fabulous Lou Reed. <laughs> Welcome back. Uh, yeah. It's very good to... Uh, it's very good to have you back on the show. Um, uh, I mean, I think the first thing, actually, I've got to say, is you're how incredibly healthy you're looking. You look like a... Uh, you don't want to ruin my career, do you? No. I've never seen you looking so well. What is your secret? Do you do... What do you... What do you I Go study on. with uh, Master Ren Guang Yi, Chen Tai Chi. He's right in back here. There he is. Oh. <laughs> Thanks for saying that. Yes, yes, yeah, right That's a deep bass player you got, Stephanie. Yeah. Whoa, you're good. She sounds good, doesn't she? She, she was brilliant. really yeah, yeah. good. Yeah, she was here last time when yeah. we were here. Yeah, but singing with the backing vocals. Yeah. And then people come to the front. Isn't so. that the way of the world? Yeah, exactly. Always the way. Boy, if he lives long enough, it'll be great. He's, yeah, it will be right. That fighting with a drum kit, that really is a thing, isn't it? Hey, I want him to do it ten times in a row. Yeah. I want him to do a solo and that drum solo and that Absolutely. together. That'd yeah, be good, wouldn't it? that would be good. It cheered me. It warmed the cockles of my heart when I saw uh, that. It made me feel good to see that. What was the... What was the that? spirit lives. Exactly. What was the... Let's go back, if I can, through the mist of time. What was the first music... Don't expect me to go with you. Oh, I'm afraid I'm going to go with you. I don't know where I was last week. What about the first music you heard? Can you remember the first music you heard? Heavy R&B. I was listening to The Sound of the Hound and uh, New York Magnificent Montague. Things like that. And there was that. Uh, and did, did Eddie that... and Ernie out of LA, yeah. Outcast, Lillian Leach and the Mellow, Smoke from Your Cigarette. That was That's your first, the stuff the I was first you got you fired up. Yeah. We've got a very good clip of you. Um, and it's, um, uh, in fact, Squeeze used to do this song. We used to do this song in pubs. And people used serious? to do that to the drums. They used to, right, right, yeah. Ah. Into it. yeah, yeah. Ah. So I there believe we go. you. Let's have a look. I'm a fan of Squeeze. Did you? <laughs> The underground song. I'm waiting for the man. And I mean, you know, that's a lot of people have been inspired by the by all those songs, haven't they? Let's face it. Do, do, when you hear people doing co covers of the songs, what do you make of them? I'm very, very flattered and happy. I love when they do it. Except when they had this German opera singer, 80-year-old opera singer, do "Walk on the Wild Side." <laughs> that, that, was, that, was a, that was a little hard to handle. Yeah. Yeah. Let's hear that. We're going to book her. But yeah, there you go. <laughs> hey, there's room for everybody. Um, now, you have a very good record out, which, is, which you've put together very carefully yourself, uh, New York um, City Man. Yeah. Now, do you, do you live in New York all the time now? Is that your home? All the time. All the time. Born and bred. I'm a native. So what is, the, what, is, what is your day in New York? When you're at home in New York, what is, it, what is, what is your day? I get up around 3 in the afternoon. <laughs> Have yes. a little, you know, I have a little breakfast, then I go out and I think about what I'm going to do at night. Mm. And what happens at night? Uh, I can't tell you, so that some things should be secret. Mm. Now, the, uh, I, the last album was called The Raven. Are you inspired by writings and poetry and that sort of thing a lot? I was inspired by Edgar Allan Poe and I decided to make a uh, CD out of the works of Edgar Allan Poe and turn it into a bunch of songs, hopefully, that people would really like and that might mm. move them. We're going to do one of them tonight. What, are, what else are you going to do tonight? Tell us what you're going to do tonight. We're going to do from uh, The Raven, Who Am I? And then we're going to do a song called Perfect Day. Ooh. Yeah. Fine, I suppose the, the question must be, what was the perfect day you were writing about in that song? That's what everybody wants to know. If I had had a perfect day, I never would have written about one. <laughs> <laughs> I wouldn't know a perfect day if it bit me. <laughs> <laughs> well, you wrote very well about it. Lou Reed, thank you very much. Ah, uh, we shall see you in a moment. Wouldn't know a perfect day if it bit him. You're right there over there now. Everything okay? Yes. Beautiful with the drum. The drums are back together now. Nice. Well done. Good. You've got to check on all these things, you know. It's not just interviewing people and introducing the bands. You want to make sure, you know, everything's safe and uh, where it's supposed to be. Now, a fantastic musical family from Tennessee, Memphis, Kings of Leon. Yeah. 